The AutoCAD 2018 release continues to improve the way you interact with AutoCAD. The file navigation dialog boxes for operations such as Open, Save, Attach, and many others now remember the sort order of the column. If, for example, you sort by date modified or reverse sort by file name, the next time you access that dialog box, it will automatically display files using that same sort order. And in AutoCAD 2018, the Drafting Settings dialog box can now be stretched and resized, similar to most other dialog boxes, enabling you to view and access more information. The True Color tab in the Select Color dialog box has been updated to accept RGB values. The previous color field is renamed to RGB color, allowing you to enter valid RGB color values separated by commas. For easy access to layer controls, regardless of which ribbon tab is current, a layer option has been added to the Quick Access Toolbar menu. Turn it on to display the layer controls along with other frequently used tools on the ever-present Quick Access Toolbar. The status bar icon for the System Variable Monitor tool is displayed when system variables deviate from their preferred values. In AutoCAD 2018, a right-click menu has been added to the system variable icon, providing quick access to reset system variables to their preferred values without having to open the system variable monitor dialog box. The right-click menu also includes options to configure the system variable monitor and enable balloon notification. A rubber band line is the line that stretches dynamically within the drawing area as you move the cursor between two points. For example, if you move or copy an object by picking the base point and second point, a rubber band line is temporarily displayed until you pick the second point. In AutoCAD 2018, the rubber band line is added to the long list of interface elements for which you can control the color. Access that control from the Colors button on the Display tab of the Options dialog box. You'll see the rubber band element displayed for all the relevant contexts enabling you to apply different colors depending on the context in which you're working.